Hey guys, as you can see, I'm in the salon today. We are at Craft Academy Salon in Houston, and we are doing pro fiber treatment on my hair. So basically, we have washed my hair, and she's going to apply the treatment, and then we just let it sit for five minutes, and then we're doing a blow So I'm excited to see how this goes on my hair, because my hair is so dry from being in Mexico that I'm really excited about this. Hey guys, so I just finished up at the salon. I'm just waiting for Cody to come pick me up and I love the treatment I feel like my hair feels so much healthier and like I said like all the damage and stuff from Mexico Was kind of extensive. So I'm really glad to get this treatment like right after my trip I really really loved it and Shelby did a really great job. She's so lovely and I'm like so excited to go back It's such a cute little unique salon. It's very like homey and like yeah, I just really had a good time in the Pro Fiber treatment. I believe retails for around $75, so if you guys are interested, definitely check them out if you're wanting to do something like that. I think it'd be a really nice like little treat to yourself and stuff. And I'm all set for our holiday parties today. Of course, the curls will fall a little bit, but I'm really happy with it, and I'm feeling so much better now that my hair is done. So yeah, huge thank you to Craft Academy Salon for having me. I had a really great time, and I'll have their information or their Instagram link down below. We are now doing what most people don't dare do. Going to Costco on a Saturday. Wish us luck. So our cart's pretty well full now, but we got some good finds. A lot of the stuff is for the holiday party tonight. So we got some cheese and croissants and hydrangeas. One of my good finds today was the Kate Spade blankets for 20 bucks. And the toss up was between gray, gray or like a blush pink and Cody agreed with me on blush pink. Thank you. Cause I feel like it's a more unique color. And then another good find we found were these macaroons, macarons. So I'm gonna get two of them. We got our pictures printed. So yeah, that's pretty much what's happening. So we've now decided to go get some lunch somewhere and we're going to the general public on Main Street. It is our favorite sushi place. It's so cool. I'll show you guys the decor when we get in. Alright guys, we got our foods. We got the Starburst roll, which is so unique. It has like cream cheese and yams in it. And then I just got a roll of yam tempura. You got mango? mango? Oh yeah, there's mango in here. Mango and then there's avocado on the top there. And then coconut flakes on the top of that as well. Then Code got a Jumbo California and some... Katsu... Chicken katsu curry. Cool. Looks good. Just got home from the liquor store and I wanted to show you guys I chose this rosé purely for the label and the fact that there's a flamingo on it so hopefully it's good but we are home we're just kind of sorting everything out and putting groceries away and getting things set up for the party. Hey guys so it's right around nine o'clock now and I just got myself ready. I did kind of a different makeup look than what I would normally do for a party but I wanted to keep it a little bit more simple and more I don't know, I just didn't want to do like liner and lashes. So this is what I came up with. Got some glitter on the lid and then a nude lip. I really like the way it turned out. And also I tried out the new Maybelline foundation. So, so far so good. We'll see how it wears tonight. I'll let you guys know in tomorrow's vlog how I liked it. But yeah, that's a completed look. And then I'm wearing that star top I wore in Mexico. And then on the bottom, I just have this like velvet green like wrap skirt. I got it from Forever 21 and I love it and I was gonna wear it to Cody's work Christmas party but we're not going so I figured I would still wear it for it tonight. And we've got the place all pretty well decorated. This is our food spread so most of the stuff we got at Costco today like the cheese, the crackers, we got some vegetables, croissants. This part's very like French inspired and then some macarons and then some tarts. So that's kind of the spread. We'll probably put out guac and chips as well and maybe some other little things but so far this looks pretty good we also changed our cinema light box and then I brought out this from our holiday Christmas party video so people can take fun Polaroid pictures with those and then now I have to hang this this guy back up and over here we have a little drink station set up so they can choose a lemon or a lime if they want cut it up with their knife open their bottles 
get their glasses, maybe take a shot, here's some straws if they want them. I really like this. This is the first time we've done this at a party and I feel like people will really appreciate it. On this cold December day, we are on our 